Hi, I'm Steve. I am the Specky Techie, and I'm going to show you how to change the RAM or the hard drive in the Toshiba Pro L850 1KM. It's a very stylish Windows 8 based laptop. Reasons for why you want to upgrade your RAM? Well, in case it's getting slower, you've got too many applications running, and you want to upgrade. So, first thing you do is this little clip there, you want to push that across that way and then hold that one there. Now this one doesn't self-retain so you have to hold it where it is and then lift the battery out. The battery should just lift nicely out. You want to leave the battery out there and what you want to do then is unscrew that and lift the panel up. The panel should come straight up with no problem. So what you want to do now is push both clips, these little clips here, push them both out and the RAM will pop up. To install your RAM, simply align that notch with that notch there, push the RAM in and you want to press down. To make sure it's in, you don't want to see any contacts out apart from that. You want to make sure that notch is in as far as it will go. So what we're going to do to make this easy is we're going to put the battery back in with the bottom panel undone and we'll fire it up and see if the RAM is installed correctly. So there you go. We can power that back off. The RAM is installed correctly. I will now show you how to change the hard drive. Now this isn't a big problem. This is your hard drive. This is very simple to do. Simply push with your fingers across whilst holding this up. You want to then lift this out and your hard drive simply comes out. So what you then do is undo these four screws here. Take this metal tin foil style sheet you want to put that underneath your new hard drive and screw it on in a similar manner to this so your flappy bit is pointing away from the socket and that the metal bit is covering up all the circuitry on the bottom of the hard drive so all you have left is your label on the top you want to put your hard drive back in the top here and slot it in now installing the hard drives in these laptops is very simple, it doesn't have to be a Toshiba hard drive, in fact I do not recommend these hard drives because they aren't that good. Simply cover everything back up and then you want to close that. So just turn the laptop back over, push the power button which is here. And there you go. It's worked. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate and subscribe.